Hey all, Heretic here, and today in the Battlegrounds, we're going to be talking about Patch 29.0, which is going live, and basically is a lot of changes to standard. Now, we only really cover Battlegrounds here. We're going to talk about a couple other little things, but this one's going to be an interesting talk, folks. I've already read this. Let's jump in and see all of the changes. First, today is March 11th. It is the 10th anniversary of Hearthstone. It has a standard mode, you know, your basic normal Hearthstone. It is quite the achievement I have to give them. Surviving 10 years as a card game, you know, we've seen a lot come and go. I know Hearthstone is so much more than a card game, but, but still, ultimately, that's what it boils down to. And the fact that it's, in my opinion, doing pretty well compared to other games who run that long. It's not just a niche little game. You don't see many people playing. It still gets a lot of action on Twitch. There's still a ton of YouTube content for it. So it's doing pretty damn well. I can't fault them on that. If you're interested in standard in the new cards coming out, there's gonna be a bunch of Twitch drops also associated with them. So even if you don't really care that much about it, you can get free cards, you can get free packs. So it's definitely something you should look into where they're gonna be giving away Festival Legend card packs. They're going to be giving some strikes. It's just a lot of, it's not bad things. If you wanna play different modes and check them out, this way you can do them for free. If you've never, never had the opportunity, you don't really wanna spend the money. So these are options for you. And the big one kinda of for, you know, if you don't have it is on the fifth drop, you get a Hearth Stonebrew Battlegrounds bartender. So if you are a Battlegrounds player, there is going to be a bartender you can unlock unless you already have it, in which case it doesn't really mean much to you. So let's get to the battleground changes because there's going to be a lot to talk about here and I really want to unpack them. First, we have Greta Gold Gun is returning to the pool. Greta is a tier 6, 2 9 Naga pirate, it means be in Naga and pirate lobbies, and that will be Spellcraft make a different friendly pirate or Naga golden until next turn. This card was fun, it did enable some things. It makes pirates in Naga both slightly more viable, finding something like this means instantly whatever you target of those tribes is going to be gold, so the value there is pretty easy to, you know, to figure out, but Greta is a good thing returning. The next thing is stay tuned for the news about our next major Battlegrounds update in the coming week. Some might say it's double the fun. Here's where I'm concerned, and here's where I'm excited. Duos, that obviously sounds like. Duos, they've touted. It seems like it would already be out, but it is not out yet. It's coming out in the coming weeks. Uh, what concerns me is the season ends in April. Instead of getting a new mode, instead of getting a new way to play Battlegrounds, are we just gonna get duos and just keep everything kind of the way it is? Maybe just go to vanilla BGs plus standard, you know, just regular cards, nothing crazy at all, and have duos as the big thing this system or is there going to be something else too i have to say if the duos is the only thing they're going to be putting out i am just horrified i i have i i know duos is exciting and it's going to be fun for about a month then no one's going to care about it so what well, yeah i want to play it yeah i want to jump into it but i know it's not going to get that long-term value having to play having to intentionally play with someone is a lot of fun when you have a significant other or a friend who plays a lot. But if you play the game solo, you don't really have any of your buddies who likes this game. This just means you're gonna queue at best with strangers? And that, no, 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 I, I don't want to play that. That's why I play Battlegrounds, so I can play the game by myself. Maybe I can queue with friends, but I'm not depending on their skill to be able to succeed at the game. Because yeah, that'll make a lot of funny moments, I also think it's gonna make a lot of moments where I wanna strangle somebody potentially on the other side of the screen. So I'm just very concerned about this. Like we just, we haven't heard anything new about anything coming out, which is normal, but we know duos is coming, but I expect duos to be out like a month ago. And then the new mode and the new season starting in April, like it's supposed to. But if the new season starts and they just give us duos, I'm gonna to have to be taking a hard look at how much Battlegrounds I wanna be playing because I don't wanna play just vanilla BGs for the next three months, two months, will they bring out one of the old modes like Anomalies or Dark Moon Fair to make up for the fact that they just had duos for the last couple months. So I'm just really hoping there's something else. And I hope you're excited. I hope BG, I hope duos is the best thing for you ever. You got bunches of friends to play with and this is the greatest moment for you ever. For me, 
oh, what other game could I play is what's coming up in my head when I think about duos for the next couple months. <laughs> That's just, just my take. Let's see what else is in the news. Well, we have a new in-game event. This is Whizbang's Workshop. Yes, it's only to earn a hero portrait. Yes, it's just packs of cards, but you do earn them while doing BG stuff. So, hey, why not take the free stuff? Maybe one day you want to play it. These are good for at least dust in the future, so this is in no way a bad thing, even if you're not really interested in this mode. They have a new hero skin coming in for Paladins, the new legendary Leroy. I mean, that's kind of cool. I'm excited about Leroy has that. Uh, doesn't help us in BGs yet, but if they're putting them in there, why not in BGs too? On the news of that, if uh, I have an old video, which I will put in the description below, where I talk about Leroy coming to the Battlegrounds. It's an old April Fool's, but it's funny, I think, so uh, feel free to take a look. There is one bug being fixed for the Battlegrounds at the moment. That's it. Nothing else. It is going to be fixed a bug where come one, come all, Silas, Dark Moon's hero power. Would it progress if the minion holding a Dark Moon ticket was the last minion for a golden minion? If it was a triple, it wouldn't count for his hero power. That's a good bug to fix. If you're playing Silas, you definitely want that to be repaired. But that's it. Nothing else. No other excitement. Other miscellaneous bug fixes. There's... Nothing else for us, folks. The BG community has been left hanging on this one, which makes sense. This is standards moment to shine. It seems like there's been a lot of standard stuff lately. It's been a long time since we got anything new. I don't count quests. Quests are old. Quests are something we've already seen. There were some new quests and the new quests were fun. So I'll give them some credit for that, but I'm, I'm itching for something new. It better not be duos. It had better not just be duos. I'm, you know, I'm actually getting mad because I, Play this game so much and I love it. And if you're gonna force me to play duos is the only fun new thing, I'm really pissed. There's gotta be something else. I am so hopeful there's something other than just duos. It has given me freaking anxiety. What do you think? Let me know in the comments below. Leave some thoughts on this. I really wanna know what you think. What do you think is the most likely scenario? Are we gonna get duos and something else? Or are we only gonna get duos and maybe stay exactly with what we have or go to vanilla BGs. How do you feel about either of those options? How would you feel if those were the things? Are you the most excited or are you right now thinking, new game could I be playing? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching all. I hope you learned a few things, not much this batch, but maybe more next time. Thanks again, I appreciate it. I love doing this all. If you do enjoy this, please hit like, subscribe, all that good stuff. It helps the channel grow, keeps me doing this. Although right now, come on guys. What are they doing to us? It looks painful. Thanks again. Catch you next time. Later.